Hey guys, what's going on? It's Baroads here, coming at you with another video, and today we're going to hop into some Youth Heroes with Leighton Orient. So, first match of the episode, it's Leighton Orient against Y2J Rizzo's side, Gillingham. Let's hope we can smash them. Ooh, Ooh Gally. Oh, Gally! <laughs> Gally's going to punish you, mate. Oh, top bends. Get him, mate. See you later, Gillingham. We're already 1-0 up, mate. Cheers the galley, good on you dude. Poor Steinson. And Zanovich puts it in. Galley. Oh. Keeper's too scared of him. Oh Galley's. Oh no, 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 no. I really hope he's not injured. I really hope he's not injured for long. Oh. Routes. If I have to take him off, I don't have to take Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh. Oh, uh, what Ryan? Why 2J Rizzo? I don't know why, but he's injured. Galley, our best player and the joint leading goal scorer. I hope the injury isn't as severe as it looks. Half time, it's it's one nil. So the second half is underway. It looks like Galley's all right to continue. So we're underway. Oh, he's oh. Oh, for Steinson! What a goal! So many times he's done it, cutting in from the right and just going, weaving in and out of players is his speciality and he puts us 2-0 up against Y2J Rizzo's side, Gillingham. How does that feel, mate? Got some work to do. Gives it to Burmeister, has the shots and it's a really good effort from him. Just wide of the post. But we are still 2 0 up against Gillingham. Oh, Gillingham uh, gave us the ball right there. I don't know what Ryan's got us got him doing on the throw ins. Again, it's Gally. Knows he can't get there. Takes it himself. Oh, he just goes through one player. Conrad, he will score 3 0. It's too easy. And Ryan, mate, I don't know what you've got him doing, but it's not working, dude. And Conrad scored against you. And Gally, I don't know. I don't know how he's done this, but he's just gone through two players somehow and puts a lovely ball through in Conrad. Nothing wrong with that finish, mate. It's 3-0 now. And that's game. It is 3-0 to Leighton Orient. Easy win there over Gillingham. Nothing went right there for Gillingham. Just we ended up the way better side there. So second match of the episode, it's Luton Town against Leighton Orient. Over to Vitali. Crosses it in, Edie's there, and it's a goal. Beautiful ball in from Vitali. Ede passes his man, and we're up 1-0 in the early light of the game. Oh, and that's the third time they kicked it out. There's something wrong with this side. I don't think it's registering in their heads that they've actually got to pass it to the other players. Oh, good touch from Braga. Oh, he puts it through. That's Puki. Oh, Puki cuts in. Gives it to Ede. Oh, he scores another one. That's a beautiful ball. I thought he was going to give it to Braga, but instead he gives it to E for his second. 2-0 to Leighton. Puki, he's just weaving in and out. Braga. Drag him in. Hits the post. Puki's still got it. Can he do anything? Oh, Ede's got it. No. Unlucky there. Ooh. That's been their first shot of the game from a corner just before half time it hasn't come to anything but definitely a decent effort gets it back that's half time it's 2 nil to Leighton Orient a double for Ede will be looking to get his hat trick in the second half but a solid performance from the lads Bracket to take he puts it in Ede is there he shoots and it's clear off the line unlucky Ooh. Oh, Luton Town. Oh, jeez. They nearly score again from a header. Oof. Again, they're wide. Oh, Zoic, good block there, but what good has it done? Oh, Weigel makes a great save. Asenio. Off to Bassi. Puts it in. Oh, Puki was there, and he was on the side too. Really decent chance for him to up his goal tally in the league. 
Senyo. Oh no, he's passed it. Oh, ho, ho, hits the post. They've still got it though. Oh, they put it in. They should... No. Vigel makes... Oh my goodness. I don't know what's going on there, but Vigel made a brilliant save. That's all I could comprehend from that. And I think Zoet's made a great block there. Yeah, good on him. Oh, he beats one. Oh, it's blocked. Alanovic, though. He skipped past one. He can do it again. It's Puki who gets the goal. It's not Eid, but it is Puki. He does get a goal to finish up the game. And he missed that headed goal, headed goal chance earlier. So it's only a redemption for the lad. And we finish another game 3-0, it looks like. Two convincing victories to start off the episode. Look at that finish. Woo. Well, that's game. It's 3-0. It's been a commanding victory from Leighton Orient here. And we drag Luton Town to the ground, away from home. And the lads are pretty happy with the result. So, third match of the episode. It's round two of the FA Cup. It's Morecambe against Leighton Orient. Some additional funds would be very great. We are a bit broke at the moment, so the further we advance, the better it is, really. The stall through the midfield. Off to Burmeister. He beats one, he beats two. He shoots. Oh, it's a great effort. And he's just such a good player in those tight little situations. You wouldn't think of it because of his tall, massive build. And a great effort there. And that'll be half time. It's nil all, and. Not much has happened, it's been a very nitty gritty game, it's... Whoever wants it, it's there, whoever wants it the most is gonna win this game. Bassi. Puts it in, oh, Boss Steins is there. Bassi will get it back. Puts it in. Keeper saves. Conrad shoots. Oh, the keeper was beaten if that was on target. No, no, please don't score from that. Good work from here, Zanovich. Puts it on. Poor Steinson. Finessed. Oh, hits the post. Oh, we could still score. Oh, that was a great effort. The keeper was beaten. That could have been the game. Oh, overlaps. Galley's in the middle. Evans puts it in. Goes to Conrad, though. Poor Steinson puts it though. Conrad! The overhead kick. That would have been amazing. Oh my goodness. The keepers just mauled him after he's taken the shot. Great effort though. And that's it. I think that's full time. It is nil-nil. There will be a replay. And that sure didn't feel like a nil-nil. It wasn't that boring. We had Conrad with that overhead kick. That would have been amazing if we could won the game with that. But anyway, it's not over with Morecambe. So guys, that's going to be the end of the episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video.